Hey, what's up, guys? Imran here, Monster Gadgets. I hope you're all having a wonderful day wherever you might be. Thank you so much for joining me. And as you can see, I am sitting in my 2025 Model 3 long range, and I am sitting in a parking garage. And uh, this parking garage is, well, I'm actually in the rooftop of the parking garage, but this is Edwards Hospital here in Naperville. And I came here for two things. Number one was to get my stitches removed from the surgery that I had on my wrist. So if you uh, have a are lighthearted or I don't know what the right word is but if you get uh, bothered by nasty stuff you might wanna turn away well I guess this is not so bad so this is what my wrist looks like right now they took the cast off and uh, taped it up but I'm gonna go ahead and show you how nasty this actually looks so again if you get bothered by these type of things I would say look away in three two one that's what it looks like currently under the stitches under the tape i guess and uh, okay now you can go ahead and look back so that's what i was here for number one and number two i wanted to go ahead and check out um summons feature that i previously tested a couple versions ago on fsd right now we're on version 13. so i wanted to check and see if uh summons has at all improved or not so let me go ahead and get into my phone here we'll get into the tesla app and uh, we're gonna go ahead and send it to um, the front door of this building from the garage and let's see if this actually works. So I'm gonna go ahead and summon. Uh, as you can see, it's gonna go ahead and uh, load up all the camera views. We're on top of the garage right here. That is the front entrance of the building. So let's go ahead and go to Target and see what happens. Hopefully it won't try to drive off the parking garage. <laughs> Previously this failed completely and uh, I'm not sure if it'll go anywhere right now. So let's take a look and see. So it's got a route here, but it's not doing anything. It's just uh, standing still. So that's kind of odd. Let me go ahead and release. It's looking for a route as you can see. I'm gonna go ahead and go to target again and see if it even pulls out of this parking spot. It will not. So let me go ahead and get out of this. Back up and see what it'll do if I do it manually. Let's check and see. Manually meaning like, let me pull out of this spot. Now that I got it teed up, let me go ahead and put it in park. Get my password in. Load up summon again. Target right there. And let's go to target. So now it's moving forward. Let's see what it actually does. Is it going to be able to go around the parking floors, the different floors, and then get to the destination? Or is it just going to go where it thinks it needs to? I don't know. Let's see. So far, after getting pulled out, it's actually doing better than it did previously. But, okay, it's using this turn signal. It's gonna try to go around. As you can see, there's nothing really there. So yes, it's gonna go make its way around. It's kind of funny that it's using its turn signal, even though there's no other way to go, but, <laughs> you know, based on the parking. Hmm. All right, well, so far it's uh, doing okay. I wonder if I would have parked away from the wall, if I would have parked like in one of those middle spots, 
if it would have been able to come but let's see what it does so far right now it's doing okay oh, it's thinking something it's gonna take I think the actual route like all the way down because I don't think he pass over the parking spots like it's not gonna cut through the parking spot oh that was a hard break why I saw the birds <laughs> um, stop due to public or high-speed road and that's what it says on the app so yeah that was that's not working that's a fail all right let's go ahead and uh, get out of this parking garage and then we'll go test it uh, someplace else and see if it works all right so that was a parking structure we were in and uh, I just drove out myself we run north parking so I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of go around to an open parking lot and then I'm gonna try and see if I can summon it back to like one of the entrances and see if it works clearly the parking garage even though it moved more than it did in the previous version meaning it didn't try to drive over a wall <laughs> to get to the bottom of the parking structure so that was a plus but clearly it is still not capable of leaving the parking structure so if you are parked this is where we were trying to get to so i'm not going to go there because there's construction going on and other stuff but i'm going to go ahead and um, pull into another spot somewhere in a busier lot and see uh, if i can summon it to the front entrance or close to it so let's see this parking lot's pretty full All right, let me know what you guys think of this uh, POV view too. This is something that uh, I'm trying for the first time. Um, instead of having my camera mounted on top of the roof of the Model 3. I don't know if I like this location. This is kind of a weird location. There's an ambulance park there. Um, and it's literally right there. No, I don't like it. Let me try to maybe park somewhere else. Maybe like in between cars. Let's try that. So let's say you got here, you parked, you went inside for your appointment, and uh, now it, you come out, it's raining, or maybe you don't feel like walking, and you want to get your car to you. So let's go into summon. So now we're, we're right there, we're within the circle. We're going to call it to the front entrance, which is right here, and go to target. Let's see how well this does. Mm, it's got her out. It's doing something. It's literally just like breaking. Why isn't it able to pull out of the parking spot? That's weird. So I'm sitting very still. This movement is from the car. Let's let go because clearly it's not moving. Let's try again. Um, come on, this is pretty simple. It should be able to back out of a parking spot. It will not. All right, let's try this. I am going to go ahead and park facing out and uh, see if that makes a difference. I think it will, but with this day and age, it should be able to pull out of a parking spot even if you are parked facing in, but clearly it does not. I gotta stop using this hand. Let's try now. I bet you it'll work now. 
Yeah, look at that. It just pulls out on its own, except it's going to the right for some reason. Instead of going left, which would have been an easier route. And let's see what it does. Oh, don't hit that pothole. Don't hit that pothole. Is it going to? Probably. Oh, yeah, it did. Interesting. I would not have chosen this route, but okay. Oh, that car's pulling out, that car's pulling out. Alright, I stopped it because it... <sighs> what the hell was it doing? That was a fail. It almost hit that car. That's not good. Um, alright. Let's try this again. This time, maybe we'll go on this side. Oh, that's nasty over there. Let's not do that. Let's park over here. So I wonder, because I was sitting in the car and I stopped it with hitting the brake. So if I was outside, uh, I would have to let go of the button to make it stop. But I wonder if it would have stopped by itself if I had not hit the brake or the actual, like in the app, the button in the app. Let's see. Trial number, I don't even know what trial this is, three, four. You better just straight pull up. There you go. Good. I was going to say if it starts to go around, like that's a big no no. No need for all that. It's definitely having a hard time. I feel like it should be a lot smoother and a lot more capable than it currently is. Like there's no reason to stop there or slow down that much. Oh, there's a car coming. What is it going to do? I'm just going to go around. Okay, that wasn't too bad. All right, so that worked. Again, a little hesitant in uh, how it's doing it, um, but, you know, I guess that that time it worked. So, I don't know guys, based on this test, especially the fact that if you park inwards, it's not going to come to you. I find that to be disappointing, I guess is the right word, with how advanced this is on FSD and how it's capable of going around streets and highways and stop signs and traffic lights. Like, come on, it should be able to pull out of a parking spot in if you park in to get to where it needs to get to. We'll do one more test here. I wanted to pull out of that parking spot, go into a different one and uh, see if you get any different results here. But I'll do it again, parking in, facing in, just to see if that was just a fluke or in fact, it does not work facing in. So let me park here. There is nowhere to go moving forward. As you can see, there's a barrier there. So let me park here and uh, see what we can do. Okay, now we're over here. And we want to get to... Let's just say we want to get to... over here. All right, we're within the circle. Oh, it is pulling out of the parking spot. Okay. Maybe that was just a fluke. I don't know. Let's see how it does. I retract what I said earlier. It is capable of doing it. It 
this was far more impressive than the last test. As you can see, it's moving much smoother. It's moving at a faster pace. It's not second guessing. And it's making its way. This gives me a little bit more confidence. But clearly, it's not consistent. I mean, in my opinion, that lot was no different than this lot. But for some reason, it didn't like something over there. So yeah, that worked. All right, let's do one more test to see uh, if it continues to perform this well or not. And then uh, we'll leave it at that. Let me pick, uh, I don't know, what's back here? Never been here before. I will park inwards again. Here, you can hardly see the parking line, so I wonder if that's gonna make a difference or not. So let me go ahead and park here. And then uh, we'll call it up there. Ooh, right on the edge, perfect. And we'll call it right over here. Or right where we were, actually, that way it's gonna go around. thinking it's in reverse oh come on tesla you can do it come on i don't know if you guys can hear that that's literally just a brake being applied by itself and then released Why, why can't you just pull out of the parking spot? That was not me, that was just a break by itself. And, Yeah, it's not going anywhere. All right, let me go ahead and stop it. Man, that's disappointing. Well, there you guys have it. Um, clearly, this is not at all consistent enough to be reliable by any means. So if you do plan on using this, use at your own risk, especially if it's raining out or something, my recommendation would be to go ahead and park it facing out like that truck. That way it has a better chance, but for some reason, pulling out of a parking spot and getting to its destination seems challenging. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give me a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.